Hello everyone, General Alpha here with another TFT video and today's portal is Spatula. So we simply have Spatula. Now let's see what we will go for here. I kinda do like Tiny Titans. But nah. Buried Treasure is really good. It opens way more options for us. Okay, we got a full Storm Weaver opener, but we already have Umbral and a Mumu and I don't wanna sell those. We need to get a really nice emblem. We can go Dryads, Porcelain. That would definitely not go in Mythic or Ghostly. We can go Dryads if no one is taking it. Nope, someone is immediately taking it. And he got a perfect opener. So, yeah, we're not going Dryads, clearly. We can go Porcelain route. That's definitely a possibility. We can definitely do that. Purchase you then. I should have kind of liked that. For now, we got the Umbral. I guess technically, we can also go Umbral, which is also a possibility. And just turn this into an item. For now, unfortunately, we're losing because we have nothing. But that's okay. That's okay. I don't like sitting on items like that, though. So we need to make sure we know what we're going for. And we need to make sure we know it soon. Okay, now we can go Umbral. That is crazy good. That is crazy good. Okay, so we will give this to the Kindred. For now, we will lose one, which is totally fine with me. And now we just need to make Yone item and stuff. We can make Shoujin. And I guess we will put it on the Kindred. Why did it only make sense? Yeah, we need it for the Aloon. We can sell the Kindred after. So we're going home, bro. They recently got buffed, so it seems just fine to me. Yeah, okay, we're losing this one. It's okay, we need, we need a spot on the carousel. So it's a good thing we bought Darius. Now we need Shen, Yorick, Yone, where's Eloon? There she is. And we need Kane, Silas, and Seth as the final Umbral. You're in. We get Reaper. I guess we don't need Nashers. <clears throat> uh, yeah, that's pretty much. Okay, just can just give it to the Amumu. This can go on the Yone. So now we need Armor or we need Rod. For a Ginsu. But for now, we kinda Gucci. I mean, uh, that, that is a good build. We just lost the first two. Because we sat on items. We didn't really know what we were gonna go for. But it was worth the wait. We only lost the first two. And now we can pretty much pop off. Especially with that Kindred Reaper. Yeah, for sure. Umbral executes, by the way, the buff. Uh, they went from 20 execute to 25. And also, uh, if you have uh, 9, which is almost impossible, I actually achieved it once and I lost because it was garbage. It used to be 45%, now it's 60. For the execute threshold. Oh, oh my god, the Yone with a bow is too good. If nobody's taking him, uh, I have to take him. Yeah, it's too good. It's too good of an opportunity to pass on. I mean, clearly I need other items, but it's okay. I mean, I need a bow. I need it anyway. But yeah, <laughs> there's nothing we can do here. I mean, we, we cannot give up Aione with, a, with an item we need, even though we don't need it exactly at this moment. That is just crazy good. That is just crazy good. So for now, we will put this on the Kindred. Because we are going to sell her anyway. So might as well have her here. Wow, the bird treasure store is really good. I was really lucky. And now I don't believe we're losing to anyone. So we just continue on this path. Of just generating giga interest. Yep, it yep. If we can achieve one more rumble, I would like that. 
That being said, we don't need Seth. We just need Epics. I mean, we do need Seth, but... Like, we don't need him for a full team right now. Yeah, you're dead. Awesome. And basically, we need armor and we need rod. Both will be insanely good. Thank you, a choice between different champions. Uh, gain two random two cost champion, gain three cost champion. I mean, what are the chances, right? I mean, statistically, it's just way better to go for this. Now we got Lux. Which I guess is okay with the Amumu. But now we don't need her. We don't need her. I mean, getting like one three cost, what are the odds? We only need two. So there's no need to go for that. But that's okay. They also, the, the recent patch notes were crazy. I mean, they totally changed Heavenly. Which is super funny because I just won first place with it. Okay, this guy's tough. This guy's tough. I don't think we're winning this guy. We're lacking the items. He rolled away all of his gold, but he has risky moves. So it makes sense. Yeah, this guy's tough. Level 2 full store weavers. That is crazy. He's going on a massive winning streak. Zoe, Sevier, Garen level 2. That is nuts, my man. That is absolutely crazy. I need this on a Yorick. I thought we were powerful, but this guy was on a different level. Clearly. So let's hope for a really nice items here. Come on, give it to me. Uh, crit is good. We can combine it with the rod. That's an item we need. No, please God. Don't give me units. Anything but units. Okay, that's good. We need for the blood pills, sir. Okay, I guess everything is kind of fine. We're gonna level up naturally because we already lost. So we're just gonna wait. By an R, by you. And I guess, like. Wait, we didn't even find a Yorick, but I guess we didn't roll for anything. So it makes sense. This is a slow roll 7 build. And everyone already rolled for the stuff. This guy has uncontested Dryads. They have been nerfed. But still, they're really powerful. Because they weren't like insanely nerfed. Yeah. They're staring us apart. Had absolutely no chance. Even with level 5, like we couldn't even take him. But that's okay. Because I believe in a giant comeback. Nobody's building Umbol, so we're completely safe. If we three star our units, it's gonna be nuts. Uh, Wrath of the Moon is insane. Let's just roll. Deal four damage every second to continue attacking an enemy. Yeah, that's crazy good. That's crazy good. And that's also a Yorick. Which I ever so desperately needs. Uh, so we'll... I don't want to take them out of Urmble Zone. So we will put them like this. And there we go. I guess Darius should be in the front. There we go. And we'll put you here. I think this is fine. Now we can put the tanky items on the Yorick now. Which is literally only the belt. But it's better than nothing. And that's good. We really need a loon, though. We really need a loon. Shen will obviously have to take the Umbral. Even though I'd re much rather put this on a cane if possible. But for now, it will have to be Shen. Unfortunately, we are lacking items. That's our only problem right now. We're lacking items. I guess technically we're lacking the level as well. We need to reach level 7 ASAP. 
I start ranking up. We need to get units. Okay, that's really good. I guess that's fine. Let's put him here. Come closer. Yeah, whatever. Okay, that's good enough. We need items though. We need armor. We need swords. Anything we can put our filthy hands on will be great. Honestly, there are so many good options. There are so many good options. But we just need items. So I start rolling for this. Nice store Reaver build. At least the good part is that everyone seems to be fighting over Story Reavers, which is actually kind of great. Oh, we're winning? Okay, great. No, never mind. We got executed immediately. Which kind of sucks. Okay, that's, uh, that's what I call a lost week. But guys, I believe. Don't worry. Do not worry. Okay, the listen. Do we have any unit we need here? No, not really. So we can take a... Uh, oh, Yona with armor is insane. Wait. No, don't take it, dude. Okay, good. That is the two for one we looked for. That's a level up Yone with the item we need. That is crazy good. Crazy good. So already we've done what we need to do. That is perfect. That is perfect RNG. There we go. You can have this. Now you can take that. And we're kind of slamming. Soon level 7. Then we tear some people apart. We do have the Umbral 4, which is insanely nice. But yeah, for now that's it. Do you give me anything? No. Okay, we're 10 times more powerful now. Actually huge. Actually huge. Nice porcelain build, kid. Nice ash, though. You're about to be owned. Yeah, Yona is crazy powerful. <laughs> Just executing people. That's what we're talking about. Now we need to go on a winning streak, though. Because we're our last, and that's a huge problem. We lost a lot of health. That being said, we got a lot of good stuff on the way. So that is good. It's important based on showing the spirit. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll take a bear for the attack, whatever. We need a sword. Perfect. Thank you. And... We got two crits, unfortunately, which won't make us any good. So yeah, we just wait. We just wait. That's it. And now, basically, we just need a rod with this for the jewel gauntlet. We have a loose crit. So we'll put it on trash for now. There's literally nothing to lose with this. We can make cane item with that. If we get a glove, if we get a tear, we can make a hand of justice for the cane. That's also kind of huge. But for now, we got the two most important items for the Yone, which I really, really like. So after that, we can go for the Ginsu, because I really want all the Yone item first. Yeah, we're clapping cheeks. We're clapping. We're clapping. We got Kindred. We got Kindred too, but we do really need a Loon. Wrath of the Moon is so crazy. Ormbo Champions have 4 damage, percent damage. Continue attacking an enemy, resist and swap targets. That is so crazy. That is actually so crazy. Especially with a Gensu. Another belt. That's a Yorick item. We got another Yorick. Nice! Okay, we got a Ginsu. Perfect. So now we need to roll until we find some Eloons. 
Okay, I can't stop until I find the loon. Okay, there she is. Great. So, you get the umbral for now. We'll put you here. You get a shoujin. You get a sword. And there's the ginsu for the final item. You get the belt. And we actually got the glove. Which will be used to make a hand of justice. I guess we will put this on a Kai'Sa. No, we can put this on a Volibear. Kai'Sa doesn't really do anything with these items. We can put this on the Volley. Yeah, we're tearing people up. Did he split into three? What was that? Okay, yeah, we own them. Absolutely massacred, no chance. I don't think I should put Yone in front. I think he get charges fast enough. It's not like he has Heavenly right now, so no protections. I'd rather just put him on the back. Seems way more useful. Uh, Jewel Lotus is kind of crazy. Dynamic Duo. Needlessly Large Rod is also really nice. It gives us exactly the item we need. But I don't want to go for it. I, don't, I also don't want to go for a Dynamic Duo. It's too risky. Oh no, Jewel Lotus. Nah. I don't like it. I don't like any of this. I really don't like any of this. But at least this gives us the item we need. Oh my god, wait, we have a Sif? Dude, that's crazy. Oh my god. I didn't even realize that. Okay, change quick. Yone here. Uh, Sif, you will be here for now. Wait, that's actually insane. That's actually insane. So we need to roll. Perfect. Wow, that is actually crazy. We got Umbo 6 already. And we can put all the items on the Seth. That is nuts. We can put the Hand of Justice on him. So, for now, we will put Volibear in. Wow, that was crazy, dude. I totally didn't expect that <laughs> to happen. Oh my days. So, yeah, you're here. Take this, Seth. Enjoy this item, my man. And, yeah, we kind of need Silas when we have the opportunity. But for now, this is fine. We can put you here. You will be here. And yeah, that seems like it. So now we just need to find Silas, and that will be huge. We found a cane. Cool. Crazy good. Okay, we got it in time. Wow, that is insanely lucky. That is insane. Dude, I got madly lucky. That is crazy, <laughs> but but I guess I'm completely uncontested, so it makes sense. But still, the percentages are low. I can't believe I got that Seth. There you go, there you go. Absolutely massacred. And the dude wasted all of his gold and he still didn't have a chance. The new Umbralus is crazy. The 5% execute threshold is crazy, it's absolutely nuts. So now we're on a winning streak, <laughs> but we still got a pretty nice spot on the carousel because we lost so hard. So we got all the items we need, now we just need a death cap, which unfortunately is on the... Oh, I thought this was a legendary. No, it was close to a legendary, just on a Malphite. That's great, that's significantly lowered the chance. Oh, the Yone though. The Yone though. Yeah, we have to go for Yone. Oh, we have to go for Yone. I mean, once you see a unit like this, we really need level 3. We really- Oh my god, we got the Silas! Dude, that is nuts. We just need to level up. Oh, we got another one. That is funny. Yeah, reason we're going for the Yone here is actually really simple. We just want to level 3 him as soon as we can. And it's way better than getting an item. So we got someone going for a Seth, which is kind of odd, but that's okay. Because we got ours. We don't really need them level 2 right now. Level 1 is more than enough. That being said, I do want some juicy item on him. Okay, this is the Dryad boy. Not gonna lie, he's gonna pay for a crime. For kicking my ass earlier. Shame on him. 
There we go. Absolutely butchered. Not a single chance, man. Not the slightest chance. Yona is, has been trying to reach her. <laughs> but he couldn't. Component envil with gold. Envil me. Slam me as hard as you can. And we will wait because we have unit phase coming soon. Any. Okay. No Yone's. And that's exactly why we took a Yone. I mean, you clearly saw six rolls, no Yone. The odds sometimes are a bit sussy. So that's why you always rather go for a unit if you want to three star them. Or it's really important to two star. Rather than to go for the item. Wait, we need a rod any other way? Okay. What can we create? I guess we take a sword, because it's good for Seth. And we'll just put whatever. Whatever we'll get from this, we can combine into some good items. Though I really hope we'll get a blood here, sir, because Seth is crazy with this item. He's attacking, and Giga cast. Slamming. Yeah. Wow, he's powerful. He's powerful. But we reach maximum stacks, you're on a casting, we got him. That was a fearsome battle. Oh dear. Okay, that... Ah, I really want to level up, but I really need that Yone. But I need to put that Silas, dude. I need that goddamn Silas right now. Come on, Seth, keep on flexing. Actually, getting Seth this early is insane. Because he just have more rounds to flex. Okay, that is good. That is absolutely fire. Nice, we got another anvil. Awesome. Oh, we got a Yone? Okay, he's level 3. Alright, we got this. Let's see. Let's see the possibilities. We also got this, which is Bloodthirster. You know what? Uh, yeah, we're going Seth. I think... This is it. And I don't think we're three-starring a loon. I think that is a misplay. We're all going to go level 10. There we go. Not the best positioning, but that's what we have. Silence will be enough. I mean, we got so many early units. We got we, we three-star the Yone. There, there's no reason to just roll away for a loon. Like, it's not going to happen. We're much better off straight up going for a 10. Much better off straight off going for 10. Wow, look at the difference. We went to 59, we were last place. And then we came back as hard as we can. And now we're first, almost. Just this guy. That is crazy. That is wild. I can't believe we had such success. So we need to swap places between you two because you have more health. That being said, we need to think of which unit we are going to take. I guess we can go Exalted with Azir. Then our team gets some bonus damage. Pretty sure that is the play. Yeah, we also get Invoker. Yeah, that's a two for one. Yeah, definitely Azir, 100%. Every single time. That That is too good to pass on. I actually kind of wish I could have sold the loon and give uh, Azir those items. But it's fine. There we go. Yeah, we're some Dude. I didn't even see it. <laughs> he just died. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. He just died. That is insane. I guess technically we can sell a loon. No, we need Invoker. If we see one more copy of the Luna, I shouldn't have sold her copy. I didn't saw I didn't see Azir. It's okay, it's not the end of the world. She's still really powerful. So we're slowly leveling up. Let's see what this guy's on. He's slow rolling, but he's slow rolling at seven, not at six, which is odd. You shouldn't do that. You you have significantly reduced rates. In which you're getting uh, those sweet greens. And clearly he's not hitting a gnar. He's not even ha he doesn't even have level 2 now on the back row. That is wild. He did end up getting Rek'Sai, but like, who cares? He got a Kindred though. That is true. But the Gnar is the most fearsome one. 
screen red is manageable. What is he building? It, what the hell is this? It looked like the most random combination I ever seen in my entire life. Yeah, and uh, he lost. No, what a weird combination. <laughs> Was it like Seth and some Morganas and Kane, some ghostly? I know, man. It was weird. But yeah, we are so far ahead. We are so far ahead from last place to first. We were at the lowest health. Crazy. Uh, Bramble is good. Bramble is insanely good. Therefore, you shall Bramble. And we slam it on Zayoric. Okay, we got Unloon. Huge. We got Unloon. So we can sell you. Just need the money. Okay, so getting that Loon there was huge. Because now we're gonna sell her. We're just simply gonna keep her for Invoker's sake. We don't even need her for her for Umbral. To be honest, we don't even need her at all. But she still executes. Oh, that's a tough question. Do we trade her item for Azir? Azir is so good. He's so good. We can give Azir room roll, technically. But we don't want him to execute because he's a slow caster. I don't know, maybe Loon is good. Maybe that. Yeah, she's executing. Maybe that will be a mistake. I think we should just slam Azir in. Yeah, she is executing. For sure. I don't think we need to give Azir items. I think that will be a misplay. I might regret that, but she's dealing damage, man. Yeah, she's dealing. She's dealing. I, I don't think it's worth it. Offer you a choice of support items. Yeah, we're winning, <laughs> naturally. Even before Richie stage 6. Yeah, Solari 100% every single time, right? We have the new stuff. When this unit dies, reduce the attack damage, but no. Uh, shoot a beam that Mana Reeves. No. Yeah, Solari is always good. And we'll put Yone here, so he can get the buffs. That is insanely good. Insanely good. So we'll wait after the dragon. Yeah, magic resist, and that, that's a lot. That's a lot. It's worth keep putting him on front, in front. That being said, I think I just win naturally. I don't think I lose to anyone. This guy has a... A Zir. With some made up items. Some desperate items, we call it. Yeah, Amumu got one shot at. Dude, Delisandra, oh my god. Okay, she's dead. But now my Yone is also dead, so he got me. He actually got me. That being said, he is level 9 and wasted all of his gold. We're about to hit 9 right now. Dude, Lissandra is such a top tier unit. Staff is better. Sandra is such a unit, bro. And yeah, we need to put you here. Because I can't have you being focused. I don't think this is a level 10 game, though. I think we have to roll away all of our gold. To hit the legendaries. Nobody's taking Seth, which is already good. And bang. Executed. Let's see. So, Seth is missing a final item. No, he... Wait, I put a Bramble on Seth and not the Yorick? Oh my god, dude, I'm so such an idiot. Uh, yeah, we can go Shoujin. Definitely. Wait, we can go level 10. Should we, though? No prison can hold me. I'm coming for you. Nah, we need to roll away. Yeah, we got it. And he has zero. Nothing. Okay, there he is. Get Shoujin. There we go. That I really was extremely desperate, but that's all we can have. That being said, we're not losing with that Seth too. Yeah, for sure. We got him. We got him. 
And now, once we put that Azirian, we're just straight up winning. And you're in. We get exalted bonuses. Let's hope for a cane up in here. Oh, we see. Did you have a cane by any chance? No. Okay. There we go. There he is. I guess the Seth Bramble was kind of quite a maneuver. We'll split both of them. And that's pretty much it. That's all we could have done. If he wins, he wins. <coughs> but I don't believe he does. We're significantly more powerful than he is. Also, Kane has Ormbol now and he's actually doing some damage. Okay, Lissandra got the useless Silas. That's good. That means Yone can smash. Seth is one-shotting. And unfortunately, he's been turned into a kettle. And he's dying. Wow. Dude, there's nothing I can do against him. He's insanely powerful. Yeah, Lissandra is OP, dude. Temporary item, which lasts three rounds. Okay, we have to go for it. Uh, Ginsu is insane. Ginsu is absolutely crazy. So, you know what? Let's wait one more round. Maybe we get an Azir item. Maybe we'll give him Ormbol. Nah, but we have Kane too. I think this is good. Ah, like, I think this is good. I have no idea. Maybe we'll change the positioning. Maybe we'll put Yone here. That way... No, you still don't get the buff. Put you, like, here. Put the Azir over there. Maybe this item will be what saves us. His build is top tier. We're playing Ormble. But that being said, I don't think it should be that decisive. Okay, finally, we went on the Azir first. Actually huge. Actually huge. We're kind of clearing. Azir is Dylan. No. Wow, Lissandra. Yeah, Lissandra, dude. I can't handle her. I just can't. Okay, I guess I can with the Azir, but... That's not enough. We were close. Clearly the positioning changed something. We need Azir items. We need a crit against it or something. Uh, let's see, an Umbral. An Umbral emblem is kinda Gucci. But maybe we need a death cap. Oh, but an Umbral emblem is something. That Umbral emblem is good. Okay. Let's try this. Man, it's so funny. We're actually one from Umbral 9. Then we would have won for sure. But yeah, it seemed like he got us. Let's try putting you together closer here. So you focus on the Azir. We're doing some experiments. Yone is jumping on the Azir just the way I wanted him to be to do. Which is good. And at least Azir is Umbal now, so he's actually executing. Okay, Yone seems to be jumping over the backliners. And some executions from the Azir, no. Nothing. Yeah, we can't do anything. Lissandra is too powerful. God damn it. Oh my god. Maybe, how do we focus on the list? How do we focus on the list? This is the only way I can think of. Th this is literally the only way I could think of. Just put on the power here. Lissandra will hopefully focus the Shen or the Silas. Yeah, she's focusing the Silas huge. Okay, so that's already a pretty huge dub for us. Hopefully. Okay, Seth finally got to cast. Okay, we got the Lissandra. Wait, cast again, Seth, please. Oh, we got him. Oh, we got him. Finally. Finally. BG. <laughs> 
Oh, that was super tense, dude. I couldn't crack it until the last moment. Oh my god. GG, my dude. What a hard-fought battle.